With most Alabama students back in school, News 19 continues to focus on school security and safety, including the role of school resource officers. And in looking into Huntsville area school districts overall, there is a noticeable gap in those resources. News 19 investigative reporter Dallas Parker has been gathering this information. She joins us now in the studio with the latest Dallas. That's right. School districts in the Huntsville area are fa all facing a similar challenge. They have more schools than school resource officers. So how does that affect school safety? I caught up with the State Department of Education Superintendent Eric Mackey for some insight. We only have a little more than 400 SRs in the state and we have 1600 schools. So clearly we, we don't have enough to cover every school with one SRO. Alabama State Superintendent Eric Mackey says some Alabama school districts don't even have a school resource officer. Uh, that does not mean they don't have an agreement with, say, the local police department or sheriff's office to provide security, but security and SRO are not necessarily the same. Some school districts, including Huntsville City, Madison City, and Madison County, employ SROs through partnerships with local law enforcement agencies. So why is it that there is not an SRO in every school during the day? Mackey says a lack of money is causing the gap. There has been a question about, well, could more money come from the state of Alabama? I say a grant that could go to, to local towns um, or counties to hire more SROs. And that's certainly something that could happen. Uh, we'd be supportive of that. Mackey says labor shortages come into play in some areas as well. But for now, he says schools are making do and trying to secure campuses in more ways than one. Uh, we know that uh, in the case of school shooters, a shooter has has pretty much never gotten through locked, uh, locked doors. So we've got to keep our schools secure, keep the doors locked. I know that parents many times uh, they get upset about that because they're used to the old days when you could just walk in and out of the school and visit school, but we're not in those days anymore. We need to keep our schools uh, locked down and secure as much as we can. Now, Mackey says even though there's a substantial gap, again, only a fourth of all the schools in the state have an SRO, 400 of them to 1,600 schools. Schools are required to have safety plans, which require things like automatic locks and cameras in schools. Of course, for a full rundown of what the uh, SRO data says about the three major school districts here in the Huntsville-Madison area, you can visit our website, whnt.com.